to Spring Batch Tutorial Series by Java Coding Skills. In previous video, we talked about a radio listener and a processor listener. So in this video, we will focus on how writer listener is work. So we are using the same diagram. So so far we have done this is this reader listener and processor listener. So here we will check how writer listener is work. So the same way something before you want to uh, do uh, writing and after writing you want to do something and in fact uh, something went on might wrong while writing so we can check that as well so directly we will jump into the coding so in this uh, uh, video also we will use the same old our traditional program where we are reading the file and persisting into the database so here already we have seen this reader listener and processor listener the same fashion we are adding a writer listener as well so without delaying uh, let us uh, create that listener so in this listener package we will create writer listener writer listener so this is also implement the same thing something like item writer listener yeah item writer listener it will took some type right that is list of employee so same way so if you open this item writer listener same this three method before write after write on write error if you observe before write it will take list of this type yes so it will take employee object and that is list of employee object because as per our chunk size configuration those many record will going to persist for a particular transaction for more detail you can watch that uh, detailed video where we discuss a lot about this chunk and all that is uh, i think a demo one video which is uh, link given in description as well so you can check that so here before write and after write both are same because uh, here we are getting input that is coming from the processor and we are not generating any output after this process right we are done because here we are reading we are processing and while writing after writing nothing will going to happen so that's what both are pretty much similar both signature except name and this parameter is remain same for both and coming to this writer the same thing one exception and a list of that particular type of object which we are going to persist into the db this three thing uh, we have so if you notice a little difference here here exception is the first parameter but i think in processor that is second parameter this is slight difference so here also here only one so there is no point of talking about that but here that exception is a second parameter but in writer listener that is first parameter this will not <laughs> impact anything just for intention i'm telling that so here you can override these three method and same way we are writing some sop here you can also add some business logic or something if you want before write before write i'm just going to print the same this uh, list of no list dot let me print that stream dot for each and system dot i think that we have to remove okay let me cut this part from here paste somewhere here so what we'll doing we will printing a list of uh, item which we are going to read from the processor the same thing we can do here as well so here i'm just writing the log but not i'm going to printing because already we printed above so it will be redundant not looks good so just after write and here of course while writing there might chance to get some exception maybe db exception or some sql exception or anything so we can uh, pin that on write error and we'll print that 
error message get message okay so almost we have done so in order to reproduce this uh, writer error right here i think we are using this predefined you know uh, default jdbc item reader so here we can introduce our custom writer and that custom writer we can write some logic uh, similar to this processor right in processor we have written something like this right so for time being we can add something like this so but i'm not going to write that uh, you can do by your own actually anyways you got some idea in that reader and processor part right so i added this but it might not uh, replicate here because the tissue might not come as we have good uh, data so we just uh, check how it's the work actually so the same way we will register this there let us register here this as well main it's almost done let us add this as well here you can add in any order the order doesn't matter so almost we have done right so let me truncate the db meanwhile and we will run that and we'll see okay truncated nothing is there let us run that what we will do is we will add some debug point as well so anyway this will not come okay before process okay our intention not to test this process let us remove this breakpoint from here and close this okay so before right we are getting here right so as our chunk size is one i think so it's coming only one record at a time oh let me uh, stop this and we will add no we will increase the chunk size so we'll get that feeling whether we are getting list of uh, element or not so provide here some two at least we don't have much record so we will give two uh, as a chunk size here so those two record will come at a time here okay it's ready yeah this time it's uh, coming as a two so this is one record this is second record okay it's fine so after write i also print it so it will keep going on as much as you have record so here after write before write and keep printing the record so in the same way you got some idea on the previous uh, read and processor part right the same way this is also there so let us confirm it db once so inserted the record right so this is how you know our listener works either it's a job listener or a step listener uh, this is very useful we can leverage this concept in our any project that is very very you know useful to track the record how it's going the flow what kind of error we are getting or any validation we want to add we can add that so we can use in uh, various use cases uh, you can decide that as per your requirement so i think you got some idea on this uh, listener part so this was a very interesting topic we had so in next video we will learn uh, some more interesting topic so please keep watching the our future upcoming video as well uh, thanks for watching please do like and subscribe the channel and press the bell icon to not miss any future notifications